final match of the bunch. Wow, dream puppets. All right, let's get our mills uh, mill on. We're playing against Sergio Biak. Um it's actually not bad. I'm running four Jace's Phantasm, so let's just uh, get him down. Let's play aggressive mill. Uh, sorry about all the phlegm sounds here, but nothing I can do about it. If you want your magic, you have to suffer my decease. Okay, so he's playing Ancient Wells, Pack Instincts, uh, Sky and Scale, Collective Might. Uh, sepulchral strength, uh, berserker rage. I think that's all of them. Let's just swing in there. Oh, you might hear a sneeze. Uh, sneeze in a second. <coughs> ah, I hope I was able to ward that sneeze off a little bit just about um ah oh man i've really been really been knocked out by huh all right uh so he's playing with 70 something cards by the way yep him not me hmm mind sculpt or all right, let's just swing in there and maybe stall his plants a little bit. Might have been the land that he l uh, he was needing. Who knows? I think j let's just stall him. I mean... I could definitely see using the uh, either adept or either adept uh, later on in the game, but just want to stall him a little bit. <coughs> Don't want to get uh, sepulchral strength off to a good start or a fast start. Okay. <coughs> Here we go. I think I got enough lands there, buddy. Um. Yeah, that's not gonna make a diff way. No, it's not gonna make a difference. So let's just swing in with these two. Bring him down to 15. <coughs> and then from next turn on, I'll have a 5-5. Five five. And, um... Yeah, it's a sorcery. I thought so. Okay. What did he lose? What did he lose? Oh, that's pretty good. Wow. Lots of good cards here. And I think I'm going to clone the Phantasm and uh, just be able to swing in for a lot every turn. Yeah. Okay. And he's sacking that guy. Okay. He's going to swing in for two. Problem is, unless he has a lot of removal, and he might have, because that deck is just filled with removal, he will lose that race. But uh, him playing with a lot of cards in this deck is certainly going to help him out. Let's see what I draw here. Yep. Wow, just a lot of lands, huh? So, aggressive mill it is. Um, he could have a uh, go for the throat in hand um so i don't want to wow what's up with the connection come on uh i don't want to clone my guy straight away okay that was fucking annoying let's keep going until we get some good uh, gameplay here and i'm playing against breno here no, I've played Collective Might a couple of times. Berserker Rage, okay. Alright, let's play Berserker Rage. I think I have two matches, two more matches in me, and then I'll say that's that for today. Good luck, have fun. Okay. Um... 
Not enough lands. Let's draw a... Wow. Okay. Uh, more lands that I... Yeah, I don't know. Let's just keep it going. All right. Um, he's playing something green. Anything from Ancient Wilds to... Well, the same as before, basically. Uh, it must be... Could be Pack Instinct. I think that is a card from Pack Instinct. The good thing is that unless I'm getting land flooded or something, um, uh, Berserker Rage is actually a really good matchup against um, <coughs> against uh, uh, Pack Instinct because Berserker Rage is it doesn't necessarily play the Timmy game, even though it is a bit of a Timmy deck, but it does have tricks and. Uh, it um, it is it can be a bit faster than uh, wow. Fangren first born. Not too happy about that. I would like a removal spell stat. That's not it, but um, it's actually not that bad to be honest. If I might even be able to, if I get to swing in with this guy and he doesn't uh, block it. Um. I could kill him in one turn, so just saying. I mean, swing in with this guy, it gets plus two, plus two, Colossal Mighted, perhaps even fires Yavimaya, and then just fling it and my opponent after the attack. <coughs> yeah, that might do it. Um, but so far he's winning the race, so... Jeez, come on. <coughs> Sorry about that. But uh, the Colossal Mites, yeah, they might do the trick. I do need more mana, though. do need... I don't even care which color. I would prefer to be a forest, because that gives me more options. But, um, yeah. What is going on with the connection? Maybe he's just thinking. Thinking about it. One more Fangren Firstborn? That sucks. That sucks. <coughs> yeah, I don't think I'm going to stand another attack, not gonna lie. Yeah, I'm dead. He started out with a pretty lucky hand, not gonna lie, and I... Wow. Okay. Okay. Eh, yeah, I'm dead anyways. GG. Actually, may... Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Um... Let's do a bit of damage here. Oh, I should have waited. Maybe he wanted to trade. Alright. And... Alright. Let's just kill that. Ah, man. So... Land fucked, even though that I, uh, the, even though I mulled down. Wow, that sucks. That sucks. Okay. I could have actually, if I had started off with that guy, with a with a maniac, Tatamunch maniac. I I think I could have won because I had everything else here in hand, and uh, I would have won. Anyways, there you go. I did say GG, he said nothing, so he's the dickhead, just like this guy. Looks like a big, purple, veiny dickhead. Alright. And UFO, UFO is going to play against Peacekeepers. Let's see how we do that. N also a deck I haven't played a lot recently, but I kind of like that hand, though. I have removal, I have a guy f on turn one, I have this guy, which is difficult to deal with, and I have... This bad boy, which is a little bit the mi mid to late game. <coughs> Obedient dead. 
maybe. Could be any number of things. Grim Procession, it could be Exalted Darkness, it could be Grinning Malice, it could be... Could be... Yeah, it's probably Obedient Dead. And my guy's dead. Alright. Guess that's that. Guess he's not going to be happy when I drop this, though. And that's actually pretty good for me as well. <coughs> so, yeah. Let's see. I think we need to get off to a pretty, like, to a fa uh, like, a, an early start. Question is, do I want to take that away from him? Or do I want... Nah. I don't know. Could take that away from him, but maybe I'd rather just keep the thing that he drops afterwards. Let's keep that as well. Um, all right, let him swing in with his one-one. One more turn. Problem is that he can easily kill the Dawn Elemental. Okay. Now I think I kind of have to drop the Dawn Elemental. Or no, maybe keep that. Because he... Mm, I don't know, but I need to take care of his creatures. Uh, I don't know, man. I don't know. He might just murder this. He might just murder it. Then again, he might just murder every other creature I have in hand. He got off to a much faster start than me. And the fact that he's playing this worthless piece of shit card is actually... It actually made sure that he got off to a faster start than me. Mm -hmm. I think you should swing in there. Alright, so he might not have the removal. That's interesting. That is interesting. Hmm. Let's uh, create some tokens here. I'm not going to attack anyway. Of course I could. But I'm not going to. Nope. <coughs> hmm. Soldier, that's not a soldier. Tendrils of corruption. Yeah. Not surprising. Oh. Oh, that does damage? Interesting. <laughs> ah, deals damage. Nice. So you wasted a removal spell. <laughs> uh, sure. Either so feel bad <laughs> I honestly wa oh, wasn't too sure about that so anyways let's just swing in with um, this bad boy guess I could have swung in with more uh, but he's up to 28 and every time he gets to attack me all right good enough do I want the captain of the watch? Not yet. Not yet. There's really no hurry, no rush, because he only has the 1-1. One, one, and I have a lot of things that I can attack with now. Rise from the grave. Okay, what do you want? Do you want the bat back for 5? That's weird. That is weird. I think I'm just gonna do the same. I mean, he has one card in hand. He burned a lot through a lot of his cards, and and he's basically top decking now. He has enough lands to drop ev everything, but I do have answers for most of his stuff. And I think if he had removal, he would have probably. Hmm. Yeah, I think if he had removal, he would have probably used it by now. But, um, I mean, 
He has one card in hand. And if he kills my captain of the watch, at least I'll have a lot of tokens. And for this deck, when you get token buffers, then uh, suddenly your side is looking mighty strong. Yep. Kill the captain of the watch. Nope. I think that was a mistake. I think that was a bit of a rise from the grave. I think he might take the captain of the watch. <coughs> I think I might O-ring it, not gonna lie. Yeah. So he gets his tiny tokens. Oh, really? Okay. Oh, right, because it was the Dawn Elemental that he removed. Okay. Uh, don't need all that land, so let's just keep it in hand. Let's O-ring this guy. I have plenty of O-rings and journeys to nowhere. Um... GG. Um, let's see if we can... Ah, oh, okay. I think he made a huge mistake, uh, or actually a couple, but he might not have had too many... Uh, might not have had too many uh, opportunities. And the match is not over yet, I mean. Who knows what he drew. Okay. Might have drawn land, might have drawn removal. Last kiss, what is he killing? Okay. Alright. Let's just swing in there. Hmm. So, still have one more turn in me and uh, still have cards in hand. He has none. So even if he draws the most beastly... Okay. Yeah. GG again. Alright. <laughs> Let's just drop this. And he has nothing, so... Stevens. <coughs> okay. I think one more, then I'm done for today. Wow, so sick.